Technology has certainly changed over the last century, even the last decade. And as technology gets smarter, it could also become more difficult and confusing when you use it. Lauren Davis teaches us some useful tech tips that might make life a little easier. Whether you consider yourself tech savvy or technologically challenged, we could all benefit from a little extra help when it comes to technology. Technology is constantly changing, and with the changes come some tips to help make your life a little easier. This life hack involves computers. When you get to a website, how do you typically scroll? To easily scroll down a website, all you have to do is press the space bar. And if you want to scroll back up, press the shift key and the space bar at the same time. If you accidentally close the tab, don't worry. By pressing Shift, Control, and T, you can open it back up. If your computer is having an issue, the easiest way to resolve it is to hold down the power button for about 10 seconds. This next hack is for those who need to send a text or need something written down, but they aren't able to type. Most smartphones have a speak to text option, which saves you time. And for the last two life hacks, I'll tell you how you can get your phone to charge more quickly. If you have an iPhone, ditch the standard charger and get yourself a 20 watt USB-C charger. It's mainly used for iPads, but if you have an iPhone 8 or newer, it can charge your phone to 50% in 35 minutes or less. Another way to charge your phone faster is by putting it into airplane mode. However, you won't be able to receive or make calls and text messages, but your phone will get charged more quickly, which will help you get on with your day even quicker. I hope you learned some tips that improved your technology literacy. I know I did. For KX News, I'm Lauren Davis. If you find technology to be confusing at times, that's because it can be. The Department of Education states that learning new technology is similar to learning another language. To look at some more tech tips, just go to kxnet.com.